The sun is in Aries and the moon is in Virgo. It's a strange combination. Aries is the get up and go. This is the entrance of Aries, by the way. We are at the very beginning, so bye bye Pisces. Now we've got male energy. It's respectively not gender male, but it is the energetic that says get up and go, put your energy up, make sure you're moving it through your body. Moon and Virgo is like, yeah, we got a list, we're gonna get things done. Can I do a shout out to my son, March 23rd? This is when the mother gets celebrated because of course, when the baby's born, it's the mother doing all the labor. So I get a little acknowledgement. And because the sun is in Aries, there is this entrance of vitality that means that the life force, which was once subdued in Pisces and creating all kinds of dreams and feelings and intuitions, now it's like, get up and go. And Moon and Virgo goes, yeah, have your list available. So leading up to the full moon coming on Monday, this weekend is a perfect weekend to get shit done. Have your list. Three planets in Pisces still, three planets in Earth, including the moon, we haven't talked about Jupiter being conjunct Uranus and Taurus. It's a very grounded energy, although it's got some chi to it. This is really where spring comes and you get to ask yourself, what am I going to do in the entrance of spring and summer coming that's going to change my energy, that's going to change my house? It's great for spring cleaning when the moon's in Virgo. So happy birthday, Daniel. Let's clean everything up. Let's throw everything away. Let's pull everything out. That's the energy of Friday, Saturday, and Sunday leading to a full moon. It's energy up, spring is here, at least it's trying, and the moon in Virgo is like, where's the list? And can I just say that the most beautiful feeling in the whole world, you all know this, is when you have a child and you're madly in love. And I pray that all mothers are madly in love with their children, but it is the truth that I did that thing. Pop goes the weasel, out came the baby. I fell in love and I'm welcoming you to share in the celebration because everyone on this planet deserves to have somebody in love with them. And the moon in Virgo is a very practical goal. Make a list of who you love and who you wanna celebrate. There it is. Spring is here, moon in Virgo, we need a list. How about who you love? If you enjoyed this video and you wanna learn more about the four elements and figure out which elements and signs you're most compatible with, click the link in the description to sign up and you'll get instant access to my Elemental Compatibility PDF.